Once the slides are in the tray, open the ScanScope interface by double-clicking the ScanScope console icon. This will bring up the ScanScope console. The slides that were last scanned will appear in the virtual tray. To replace the tray with the new slides that you want to scan, right-click the Start tag. To select all of the slides in the rack, left-click the top of the virtual rack, directly on the word Slide at Rack. Right-click in the same area and select Replace Rack from the drop-down. This will turn all of the slides dark gray, depicting that they are ready for a snapshot. If your tray is not full with five slides, then simply left-click on the slide that you want to remove to select it. Then left-click the selected slide and choose Remove Slide from the drop-down. To get snapshots right-click the top slide tray on the word Slide Rack and choose Get Snapshots from the drop-down. Alternatively, you can select Get Snapshot for each individual slide as depicted here in this video. Once the slide snapshot is complete the slide will turn from dark gray to baby blue. Once all of the slides have its snapshots, you will need to review the snapshots for each slide. Right-click on the first slide and choose Review Snapshot from the drop-down. A pop-up will appear with a large image of the slide. You will notice a green box and a blue dot. The green box is the area that is to be scanned, and the blue dot is the Y balance. The computer automatically chooses the white balance, but if you choose to move it located close to the green box and away from any tissue. The green box should be as small as possible to decrease scanning time and file size. If there are multiple levels, choose the most representative level to scan and do not include the others. Once you are done cropping the scan area, click Find Focus Points. The slide will turn from baby blue to royal blue to indicate that the cropping is completed. Click the red X or the close button on the pop-up when this step is complete. Move to the next slide and repeat the previous actions to set the scan area. Once all of the slides have their snapshots reviewed, click the One Touch button in the bottom right hand corner. The scanning will then start and will move through the tabs from right to left automatically. When the scan is completed the slides will have changed color from blue to green, orange or red. Orange indicates that there may have been a focus problem, and the slide should be checked for quality. However, historically the orange images have been of acceptable quality. Green indicates that the scan is completed and is of good quality. Red indicates that the scan did not work at all for some reason or another. Look at the error box to troubleshoot if it is available.